Back-to-back -back trips to the big dance. Only the second time that's happened in the history of this school as we are off and running here in Boise. Teams that mirror each other, they really are defense-centric. And both coaches talked about rebounding being the key in this game. Broncos were beaten here at home on Tuesday by UNLV as Dagan Hard, pretty two-man game as Max Rice sets the table. But that loss by the Broncos on Tuesday to the running Rebels ended a 22-game home winning streak here. It was actually the longest active home streak of any team in the country. They have been so good here as Lamont Butler. One other injury note for Brian Dutcher and the Aztecs. They get Darion Trammell on Trammell. Beg your pardon, back today. Didn't play the other night. Was under the weather. So he was in position to get his hands on that pumpkin and force the hell ball. Ladine's going to face a lot of double teams. The pass to Saunders was broken up. Ladine on a fade. First media timeout when it happens. There's Darion Trammell again, didn't play on Wednesday. Such a big piece, good looking turnaround by Waters. And he's 100% now, and he certainly looked like it on that turnaround jumper. Saw the drought for the Broncos. Anderson, beautiful hesitation, and he finally gets Boise State back on the board. A reset here to Rice, sixth year. He's going to hoist from deep, got it! Boy, when this team can hit the three. And the Broncos doing a terrific job on the defensive glass. Boy, Rice with a deep shot. So too are the Aztecs. Nobody's gotten an offensive rebound yet in this game. Trammell all the way to the rack. Are you kidding me? I've, I've seen your, your pictures from your prime. <laughs> and that chiseled Clark Kellogg physique. Anderson's going to let it fly. Got it! Anderson against Trammell. Shot clock now into single digits. Stanley. If he know. Wants to take Powell. He's going to shoot mid-range. Boy, you talk about improvement offensively. Leon Rice told us that 40 days ago, he could barely post up. Yeah. Well, he, he started the season. to find himself. Yes, Bill. He started the season coming off the bench the first several games and has been inserted into the starting lineup. Oh, wow. I don't know how. Dagan Hart missed that one. Miles Bird's going to shoot when we come back, but it's Omar. Butler and Powell giving chase. This is Dagan Hart. So much versatility to his offensive game. Anderson, the crossover over the top Beautiful. of Butler. Last year, four teams from the conference got into the dance. Wonder what that number will look like this year. I think four is the basement. If things hold as they have. Oh, what a tough shot. Kind of looked over and said, boy, that kid has got something <laughs> special about him. So Leon says that Robin takes credit. She should. For the player that, that Tyson has become. And there he is right on cue. <laughs> Micah Parrish defended by Meadow. And another takeaway for the Broncos. Whiting's going to hand, gets it back from Rice. Whiting walks a tight rope into the corner. Meadow, splash. Here's Parrish trying to knife into the paint. Boy, the regather, strong move to the cup. Defense by the Aztecs there. Butler weaves in. This is Saunders from the top of the key, and he banks it in. First three for the Aztecs. Boise State trying to start another long win streak on their home floor. Their 22-game streak ending on Tuesday here. Stanley says why not? Dagenhardt has been the guy on him, double team. Now you got to rotate. Good job that time. Nice take. Waters stops on a dime and puts it down for the Aztecs. The Aztecs are searching right now to see where those points are going to come from. Well, the guy with the ball can certainly get it going. Darion Trammell, and so can this guy, Jay Powell. Good looking stroke deep in that right corner. Aggressive, tough, nothing really easy. And we expected that, girl. That's how these teams play. That's the, uh, the drought up until that bucket by Anderson. So a two-point game. Anderson got him reset. There's Cam Martin who's back into the game. This is Stanley again from deep. Bangs in another triple. Come on now. Boy, waiting, getting to the rack. Couldn't put it down. Here comes Lethe on the push. Hero step and lays it up and in. Big fella. 
collapsing to the wreck. And San Diego State's three-point struggles continue. They're now one for nine from deep. Anderson creeps into the paint. Parrish got a piece. He's got it going the last nine games. Going to be key that he fall. Oh, wow, what a shot by Tyson Dagenhart. Tough angle. See, he can get a shot here if he wants. Not too. Double team kicks. Finds Whiting wide open. Get it. Big bucket there. Wow. Leon Rice loves the grit from this kid. Big basket as the lid finally comes off the rim. Good find by Ladee that time. Tramiel on a three-point jack. Max Rice, a three, missed it. Ladee off the floor. This is Waters left wide open, and he bangs in a triple. Told you about Waters' backstory. Last three years at USC, last year was the sixth man of the year in the Pac-12. Highlighting that point. Heidi, boy, somehow able to squeeze it, maintain concentration as Stanley nearly had the intercept. He has played his way into Brian Dutcher's rotation in his first year in this program. Martin, left open. Big fella. Over nine minutes to go in this one. So the Aztecs lead short-lived. Offensive rebound and the three. It's Parrish. So now eight different Broncos have hit a three in this game. That's Stanley. Talked about his ascension since the middle part of December. If this team's going to make a deep run, Stanley is going to be a big part and a big reason why. This is Jermell. The spin and the shot. Anderson trying to fight off Jermell. Works his way down to the box and he hits. Despite the help defense coming with Heidi. Boy, if Boise State wins this game, it's going to be because of guys like Anderson and Omar Stanley as both into double digits. That is Trammell. Wow. Two or three more than your opponent. Dagenhart puts it on the deck. Boy, good defense from Saunders. Dagenhart just too good. This is a tough shot. Goes to the kind of blended hook. Compliments of a couple of threes. Winning that matchup from a point stand standpoint. The matchup again right here. Stanley's going to defend. And Ladee over the top. Both ends of the floor. San Diego State 15 and 3. They're 4 and 1 in conference play. Stanley dials one up from deep again. Bronco star. Well, I tell you what, Brian Dutcher's probably shaking his head at this. I mean, you go with percentages. He's 21% coming into the game today, and he's made three of them. Broncos looking for an uppercut punch right here. Dagenhart extends Pell, turns him back. Oh, and you've got defenders backpedaling. You feel like you can create some space, but you're right. There was no room for him to really make a play there. Boy, Dagenhart, the quick spin, but an even better recover. Parrish and Waters for Brian Dutcher. Dagenhart, hard fake, slithers into the paint, lays it up and in. What a nice job, not settling. Basically, you're saying there's some good pieces here yes. and there's more room for growth. Same with San Diego State. I mean, that's why it's going to be so much fun watching the Mountain West the rest of the season. Colorado State, Utah State. But don't settle for bad one. That's a good look. Miles Bird, back rim, and it's Butler. Waters from the splash. What a job by the Aztecs. I like this. Don't allow him just to walk it up. Put some pressure on, but don't foul. And now back off. Butler. Boy, gotta have a sense of urgency there. Got it! Butler got it. Wow. One second. Again, they're out of timeouts. They can't stop it. Inbound Abo, and it's over. Wow. Boise State has survived, and they get a massive conference win.